Hello everyone, it's Sid Reverse here, and today I'm going to be drawing my entire fucking life. Just like most people, I was born on a farm in Texas in, uh, yeah, one of them years or something. Anyway, until I was a teenager, I was just a normal boy. I was a bit below average in intelligence, but overall I was pretty normal. At age 15, this strange individual brought me to a testing facility. I was stuck there for the rest of my fucking life. Well, that's what I thought back then anyway. This individual named himself Gary, and oh my fucking god, I hate Gary so much. He's a shape-shifting, reality-bending son of a bitch, and he got me trapped in there for about fucking, I don't know, uh, 12 years, yeah, that was it. I was a 27 when I got out. I was finally rescued by this suited individual. His name was the Railroad Man. He offered me an offer I couldn't refuse. He told me that if I got out of here, I would be turned into the perfect human being. So I obviously, I said yes. He transported me to this very small little man. He looked sort of wrinkly, yet like a child at the same time. He introduced himself as Tiny Baby Man, and he's like a thousand years old. He may be a tiny baby, but he's a hell of a man. When he was working on me, he made me perfect physically and mentally. He didn't make me too intelligent. He made me smart enough to comprehend the world, but dumb enough to not criticize myself and get on with the task at hand. I also have a very strong mind, which is why I could look at all of the railroad man's anomalies and not get affected by them. There was only one thing that went strange during the transformation process. Tiny Baby Man gave me a British accent instead of the southern accent that I used to have. This change actually led me to do commentary at all the big sports events. When me and Tiny Baby Man got rich, we decided to take a chill lifestyle and make YouTube videos together. Bending reality is fun, but there's nothing like talking to you guys. Like, subscribe, comment, follow, look at my house, and I'll see you in five minutes.